Hey Mops, Marpu here, and welcome to Mox Review. We got something amazing. I know I got the long hair, so amazing we're gonna review today. An Enderoy Dobby from My Hero Academia, also known as. Oh, sorry, I won't. I won't. I'm not gonna spoil nothing. Uh, I I've been reading the manga, and yeah, I know. I read. And also, nope, that's, that's something else. Where is it? Oh god, where is it? Oh, <laughs> Yay, my favorite, my villain academia. Yes, I've been watching the anime too. And this was for my birthday too, my my little gift. So I love it. One of my favorite ones actually. Like, well, technically this is the only manga I've ever bought and owned so glad to be this <laughs> anywho there he is <laughs> but yes Dobby from My Hero Academia from the League of Villains to the Liberation Army oh fuck well fuck it I guess sorry uh to my computer. Uh, anywho, and now I know it's been ugh, whatever I'm in here. I mean, whatever. Let's go to the corner and uh, much better. Let's go to the corner and review the toy, shall we? Corner! And here he is. Dobby in the flesh. <laughs> oh, a tiny version of Dobby, that is. Oh, it's amazing. Just beautiful. I mean, look at this guy. He's so small. And yeah, he doesn't stand. That's why he comes with a stand. Again, Nindoroids are not that known for them to stand on their own. I mean, they can. It's just a pain in the ass to get it. But regardless of that, look at this boy. Beautiful. All those burned scars. I mean, look at the details. Even the cheeks, you can see the burn, the little, little staples, the hairs. I love it, but careful, it's spiky. So, oh god, it hurts, but I love it. And there's a blue crystallish uh, plastic blue flame ball. I love it. Transparent and everything. Even the jacket. I mean, look at this beautiful ball joints here again to make an effect uh, for the jacket to move. I mean, when he's wielding his fire. Um, again, it's just amazing. All the details. Uh, it's, um, it's just amazing. I love it. I love it. But let's stop and talk about Dobby for now. And let's talk about his uh, accessories. So, of course, the first one you see here is his stand. So, it's pretty simple. You know, plug this uh, stick thing into any hole. And after that, you can do whatever you want. So, of course, all of them has a hinge, you know, as you can see. And, of course, uh, this uh, thing does uh, come off easily. But, of course, you know, that's meant for the back. So, I don't worry, worry too much about that. And like so, just get Davi here, and you see the hole in the back, and plug it like so. Um, doing this at a weird angle, but it still works. <laughs> now, the reason why the stand is, looks like a C, because of the tails of the jacket, you can see it has more room. Um, that way, it doesn't get away, it doesn't get the way of the stand thing. Yeah, I mean, it's a marvelous, don't you think? Now, of course, the next thing I want to talk to you about is his uh, changeable faces. So. Let me just set this up so you can see how marvelous. Uh, let me get stand here to make it much better. I forget he doesn't stand well. But yes, the first face you can see here is the crazy face. The <laughs> face. Uh, it's easy to take off. You know, you just take off the hair, take off the he head, and replace it like so. Sorry, there's a weird angle. And easy peasy one. Once and breezy. It's a uh, oh, hey man face. It's. Not my favorite, <laughs> but eh, okay. And the last one is his uh, normal face, his bitch racing face. The hmm, let's see what you did there. I like it. But of course, my preferred fair, uh, preferred face is. Let me just get this here, and there he is, Dav Shigaraki. <laughs> No, no, the other Nendoroid does not fit with his face at all. The uh, reason why it's kind of a loose and slash tight fit, so yeah. You want to change faces? Ain't not going to work. <laughs> but of course, if you want to leave this face on there, you can. It'd be terrifying, but you can. Uh, let me just uh, get... Uh, oh, let me show you how the bag looks. See? But yeah, let me just get his uh, the face I want. The... <laughs> 
face. Uh, I don't know, the crazy mania effect just works for me, just so beautiful that way. But of course it comes with more than just the faces, it comes with this blue effect flame here. Um, it's a, I mean the bottom piece, I like it. Uh, acrylic I guess is this what it is I don't know it's just plastic it's all uncommon what it is but yeah you just put it right beside him no plus are needed so yeah sorry about that the arm just came off uh they easily come off when you move them too much around so yeah that's my fault but yeah you just plug plug just put this beside him make a cool effect and of course with the jacket um you know you can move up and down, make it like a cool effect. His flames are behind him or in front of him. The way, whatever you want. I mean, I love it. I really love it. I really do. I mean, that's a little tiny piece there uh, to celebrate, I guess. Now let's talk about the big thing, the hands. So all of his hands can change. Uh, we have a good selection of it. And it's pretty easy to take it off. You know, just grab it and pull. It's pretty much easy. And insert a new hand. So of course, this one has the little marble. Um, that's where I believe in season two when he holds uh, Bakugo, you know, checkmate, poor little Shoto Todoroki, you know, if you remember that line, ah, I do, because I've seen this uh, uh, anime so much. <laughs> but yeah, and the other hand, it comes with, uh, oops, see, I'm saying you move this too much, it pops out easily, but I don't mind it. Um, it's, you know, just a uh, hand relaxing, I guess, just, hey, how you doing? Want to shake hands? And of course, uh, the louder one that it comes with is, let me see, ah, the pocket hands, of course. So yeah, so you can see the other one, it has the same one too. So basically these, you want, know, oops, sorry about that. Uh, basically you just want to uh, make him look like his hands are in his pocket, basically, which he's always has those. Every time he walks around, he's always having his hands in his pocket. He's just that cool, you know, it makes, it makes it look cool. I mean, close up, you can kind of see it's not far away. Yeah, it gives you the illusion that it is. So I, I like that detail. Um, yeah, <laughs> but that's not the only thing it comes with. Of course, the other hand, of course, we got, you got to respect the left one, right one. Depends on your angle, my angle, your angle, whatever angle, even the toys angle. <laughs> so the other one, of course, it comes with uh, the other relaxed hand. Uh, hey, how you doing? Want to shake hands? And of course, another hand. And this one's a little bit of a pain because uh, kind of this one you kind of have to angle it per se because of the blue flame. So this one's a little bit hard to put in. Um, <laughs> not my favorite, but still looks cool. It's basically you want to insert this backwards so you can see here. Oh come, come on! Again, I'm doing this at a we were in go, I wish I had a table to do this, but nope, this is on the floor. This is why I decided I'm dedicated to this. Oh God, no. Oh, okay, I'm gonna do this in front of me. <laughs> okay, here we go. And there we go, somewhat better. So basically, yeah, this is just him like showing off his blue uh, flame effect. Uh, Basically, this one is only like if you want to put this on the side of him. And of course, you can take the blue flame off, but of course, you see this little peg there. So, eh, I don't like it. And of course, there's an indicator like where the hand thing goes. So, yeah, it's pretty easy, but yeah. This one is mostly just keep him behind him or just in front of him because you can't really do much with that one. And the last uh, modification you can do with this guy are his legs. So, both the legs are removable. Um, so, you can move this like just you know pull it down don't worry you're not gonna break this toy and you can exchange this to this bent leg so both legs so the legs don't bend except for this uh one it looks like it bends see you can see here this way you can make uh, an effect like he's jumping or you know again with the flame effect it makes it look, look cooler um let me see if i can display yeah <laughs> that doesn't look cool again i'm not i'm not a toy model whatever you want to call it um, uh, I guess, nope. Uh, let me see if I can make it a cool pose for you. Hey, I guess that looks cool. <laughs> uh, give me a second. There we go. Much cooler, I guess. I don't know. I'm not a toy position master, whatever you want to call it. There he goes. I mean, let's, uh, that's what I was telling you with the blue flame effects. Uh, I mean, it looks cool. Again, you can rice up the jacket and everything. It's amazing, really, but I, again, I'm sorry if I'm not putting this in a cool pose. But yeah, I mean, he, he, use your imagination what you can do with this. I mean, look at this. He's 
skipping and hopping because his feet are burning. <laughs> and of course it comes with an extra neck piece. Uh, this is a peg for the neck. I don't know what you're doing that you break it, but yeah, it comes with that. Now the sad story, the floosh, the foom effect, whatever. Um, so you're supposed to get another uh, hook, you know, the same hook that you plug in Dobby, you know, you're supposed to get another thinner hook to hold the floosh effect, but I don't know why or what the hell happened. My box, I guess was a defect or something because I do not have that. It didn't came in with the pieces at all. So I'm like, what's going on? Why I don't have this? Um, I know where I'm supposed to have it, but nope, it did not came with it. So I am missing a piece. So I'm so sorry about that. Uh, Hey, uh, can, uh, Nendoray, can you send me a spare piece? I'm missing one! <laughs> but yeah, uh, and as I'm disappointed with that part. I'm like, uh, I can't display a piece in here or show it to you guys, but yeah. Speaking of showing, let me show you what Dobby can do. So, of course, his head can tilt this much and, of course, can go up this much. Uh, and, of course, you can turn it all around, make it like the exorcist. No, 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 no. <laughs> And of course, uh, the same thing with the arms can go up this far, and of course, you know, if both bend. And of course, the hand does, you know, turn 360 degrees, you know, all the way around. I mean, of course, it's a peg, so you can turn this all the way. And of course, again, with the back pieces here, with the jacket, uh, you can move it all around. And of course, the hips do uh, swivel here and there. <laughs> and of course, the leg uh, does uh, move around as well. And of course, uh, you can take those off in order to make it bend, of course. But yeah, um, again, not much mobility, but of course, do you really need much mobility with Davi? I mean, he doesn't really move around that much. And of course, for size comparison, he's my favorite boy, Tobra Shigaraki. Oh my god, his hands fell. Uh, it, 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 it. Sorry about that. Uh, technical difficulties, give me a second. Alrighty then, there we go. Tobra Shigaraki next to Dobby. The leader of the villains, all for one, Warp Gate villain, Kurugiri, and of course, Isuku Midoriya, aka Deku. But yes, um, with all the accessories and you know how much detail this guy is, it's amazing. I really love it. Again, from the blue flames to the jacket, you can move it around. I mean, this is like the spinning life image of Dobby just in a cute form the chibi is it right uh, thing I don't know but I mean it's amazing again I'm disappointed that a piece is missing but regardless of it I mean the spiky hair the crazy look I mean again I love it and no he's well he is a my one of my favorite characters but not the favorite that's Shigaraki for you but yeah <laughs> I do highly recommend this piece and of course you can get this at the big bad toy store Ooh. come on let's get back to me shall we let's go so yes Davi I love it I mean uh, the accessories that come with it like the wood the, the fush flame whatever thing the little interchangeable he heads the the marvel, the hands, and all that, even the extra foot. It's amazing, amazing. And, you know, it really does look like it's Dobby, just a little cuter, I guess. You know, he's already cute, Dobby. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> uh, again, the only disappointing part is that, uh, again, my, uh, yeah, you can hear it, that my copy was defected ish. Uh, that it, it came with everything except for that one part that that piece that was supposed to hold the wash part um, again think maybe I could call the company maybe um, so, something to see if it can send me something or maybe I could have sent this back and you know, get a replacement or a different toy but do I really? I don't want to go to the trouble of that to be to send this and wait another week and all that. Like, yeah, it's not worth it for me. To, even something for that thing. And plus, I wasn't even really gonna use it. So it is a it is a pain in the ass. But um, to not have to not have it complete. But still, um, hopefully this is just my copy and not anybody's copy. If it is, I'm so sorry. 
But yes, regardless of that little complaint really that I have, because I don't really have any other complaints, that that One Piece thing came, I still recommend it. I mean, again, Dobby, it's... From my hero, one of, it's a very popular anime, and it is a very popular character, and it's gonna be popular when you find out his secret identity. I'm not gonna reveal it, uh, but if you, oh, shut up. Um, but yeah, but of course he's not my favorite. Tomura Shigaraki is my favorite character of the entire My Hero Academia. Even though yes, I've been reviewing Tomura and Deku, but. Hey, those are the, are the statues and toys I've been finding on, on the on, on the store shelves and toy toy stores. Then I could go order other toys, but I, I don't want to eat a Tenya. I don't want a Ochako Raka. I definitely don't want a Bakugo. I mean, I'd like them, but I don't want a toys version of them. I want a Kurugiri toy. I want an all for one toy. I do want that off this statue. I do want it, but I cannot find it at all. Um, if any of you know where I can find it, please let me know. I want, I want that. I want that in my collection. I definitely want that. Maybe in like an anime con, I will find it. Anyways, I don't know. But yeah, um, again, I highly recommend this toy. Again, it looks like Dobby. You can, you can feel like the personality coming in, the craziness side in it, and of course with the blue flames and effects and everything. And of course, it goes well with other characters. I mean, you saw it. it it goes along well with my Tomo Shigaraki on Android 2. So, yeah, I highly, again, I highly recommend this one. And again, I hope that was the, my the only defective copy that they came with the little stand for the whoosh, flush, whatever fun effect part. Um, oh, and uh, where can you. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is still. A little scratch from doing God of War, the boy stuff. Um, where can you get this, you at? You ask, huh? You can get this at the Big Bad Toy Store. Hopefully, it's not sold out because this guy, after literally the next day when I ordered this, like I think it was around March when I ordered this, next day, sold out. So, right now, I don't know if it is sold out or not. I'm actually checking right now. Uh, da, a B. Mm, oh God, it is sold out. Shit. Well, I'm still gonna leave a link in the description because uh, same thing when I did the. Uh, Godzilla, Godzilla versus Kong. Uh, the Godzilla, uh, S uh, S H Monster Arts Godzilla from Godzilla versus King Kong versus Kong. You know, it was sold out at the time, but it it's back back in stock and back to pre-order. So who, who knows? Maybe they will have another pre-order for this. So hopefully, it's cross our fingers and hopefully you'll be able to get it. I'm still gonna leave a link in the description below and hopefully. Uh, you get a have a restock in this, and uh, hopefully you'll be able to get it. Um, you can try toy toy stores and all that, but again, as a pop, this is a popular character. This sells out quickly, okay? This Davi is one of the most popular characters from my hero, and of course, he's cute regardless of his burn scars and his uh, craziness. But yes, highly recommend it. Again. Anywho, I hope you enjoyed the reviews, and I hope you enjoy every other video I put up, even the crazy stupid ones, which is all of them. Yes. Like, comment, share, subscribe. This is Mark Hill. And Dobby. I can't do Dobby's voice. Tomura Shigaraki. Oh my! I, yeah, my voice is really scratch. I I feel it. Anyways, please like, comment, share, subscribe, and this is Marpool signing out.